Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This week I'm showing you the Shark Anti-Hair Wrap Vacuum. I'm going to do a really quick review on it, basically show you how to put it together, what accessories it comes with, and I'm going to show you the vacuum in use. So the vacuum does come with a user manual and it says that you can put it together in five easy steps. The five easy steps are also instructed on the box that you can see in the video here. You get um, three additional pieces that come with the Shark Hoover. So I believe there's uh, the three attachments are kind of uh, a Hoover wand, a dusting attachment, and then as you saw, the Blade Runner attachment. So here I'm gonna start putting the Hoover together. I'm just laying everything out in front of me so I know which one's the wand and what goes where. It was quite easy for me to put it together all on my own and only took a few minutes. Everything just snaps into place and clicks into place and I wasn't at all confused. Whilst I was putting it together, I could see it becoming um, apparent that I could use this Hoover for hard flooring and also carpet. So as I'm putting this hoover together, I'm making sure I'm pressing everything until it clicks securely into place. I'm placing the pod onto the wand and I'm sliding everything down to connect. And then I'm connecting the hose onto the back of the pod and making sure that clicks securely into place as well. And after that, I'm just gonna store the included accessories on the accessory posts on the pod and make sure everything's firmly in place and then I'm ready to go. So if you just keep watching, you'll see how well this hoover works. I'm already giving it away that I'm so pleased and so happy with this hoover and I'm definitely recommended shark. So I'm going to plug the hoover in now and I'm just going to start on a patch of carpet that is one of the main walkway areas in our house. We do have a cat, a long haired cat, who drops quite a lot of fur even though he's groomed every day, which is one of the reasons we went for the anti-hair wrap technology hoover from Shark. We've tried lots of other hoovers in the past, we get through a lot of them very quickly and I must say this is the first hoover that I've used where I've seen a real difference. So you saw that the cylinder was empty when I first started using the hoover. I'm just doing this one area. Pressing the hoover out on this one square patch of area. It's by the back door and at the bottom of our stairs. So like I said, it is a busy area for our family. And I'm really impressed with how the hoover has picked up the hair and any additional debris that was on the carpet. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give it a go during this video on the hard floor as well. But at the moment I'm just going to finish off the carpet and have a go at using some of the other accessories. So I'm going to try using the wand now and hoovering the separate stairs. I really like this little contraption. Um, it just looks like a mini roller that's going to be great on each individual step. So I'm going to turn the hoover on again. I'm just going to have a little buzz around these stairs and see how much dust and fur that I can collect in all the hidden nooks and crannies. Earlier how I really liked the instructions on this Uber. Like I found this little attachment and I wasn't really sure what it was really for until I saw this side sets for use for fine dusting. So I thought that would be great for doing things like banisters and window ledges that you can't really reach. So I went on to test the anti-hair wrap hoover on the laminate flooring and I was really pleased with the way it glided along, it felt really smooth and it picked up any additional dust that was on the floor. I like the lights on the front, it helped me get into all the little, little nooks and crannies. So in this video here, I press this lift away button and the whole pod comes off. But actually, to empty the front container, you don't need to take this whole pod off. So if you just carry on watching, I'll show you how you can take it off an easier way. Unfortunately, my main battery ran out of camera, so I had to use 
uh, my Olympus which has a real close-up lens so there's some really nice close-up shots of all the dust that the hoovers collected but um, it kind of shows here that I was able to take the front off with this little clip here so if you just give it a press and then the whole section at the front just comes apart and I was able to take it outside and empty it which I will continue showing you in the video. There's a nice little reminder here to tell you to change your filter every three months. And here's the pod outside and me emptying the dust which uh, yeah it was just so satisfying to see that come out. And as soon as I emptied it literally all the dust fell out. I didn't have to clean it or brush it down or anything. It was ready to go again as soon as possible. So thank you so much guys for watching this review video today. I find the little review videos on my channel does really help my YouTube grow. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you again for another video soon. Take care. Bye bye. Thank you.